If you cheated taxpayers when it came to collecting COVID relief funds, the government is coming for you. That's the word from Homeland Security. At your Grand Rapids man was sentenced this week for doing just that. News H. Joe Lafergie has the story all new at 7. Along with crowded hospitals, closed schools, and political discord, businesses also took a major hit during COVID lockdowns. So Congress passed and then President Trump signed the $2.2 trillion Coronavirus Aid, Relief, and Economic Security Act, or CARES. About $659 million of that act provided businesses with a way to pay employees who couldn't work because of shutdowns through the Paycheck Protection Program. But the government says some employers took advantage of that relief and Eric Post was one of them. The original loan, it's my understanding, was a little over 300000 so the restitution uh, was ordered at 217000 Post, who pleaded guilty to bank fraud in September, owned a company that provided financial services to local businesses. The government says Post inflated both his staff size and payroll expenses in applying for a paycheck protection loan. Along with the restitution, Post was sentenced to 18 months in prison for the scheme earlier this week. So if Post wasn't putting the money towards payroll, what was he spending it on? It's my understanding the investigation uh, proved that it was for personal expenses. Another federal agency tipped the West Michigan Homeland Security investigations off to the fraud. Flanagan wouldn't provide specifics on that tip. Agents don't want the bad guys to figure out how they're caught. This fraud's not a victimless uh, crime. But he does say the investigation should send a message to those trying to defraud taxpayers but there's a good chance of getting caught. It really affects the honest, hardworking taxpayers throughout the country, and it affects the, uh, the honest businesses that are working here in West Michigan that really were trying to keep people employed during the pandemic. If you suspect fraud connected to the payroll protection program, call the HSI tip line at 866-347-2423. In Grand Rapids, Joe Lafergie, News 8.